Hello presenters, I hope you're well and I hope that even now really early into 2021 that you guys are starting to rethink, refresh and represent the way you're delivering content to your audiences. And I want to help you go to the next level. So you'll probably notice that a lot of my tutorials and tips and even webinars that I deliver will always use the Prezi video software. Now, the reason I use Prezi video is because I want to bridge the gap, the gap between me, the presenter and my content. So let me show you exactly what I mean. And I want you to stick with this video because there's an even higher level that I believe we can take things to. So with Prezi video, I can take a subject like, for instance, the humpback whale. What an incredible animal that is and what a wonderful photo we've got here. I can bridge the gap between that content and me, your presenter. So you can see us existing both together in the same space. Instead of me floating around at the top of your screen in a postage stamp sized little window on my webcam and my presentation slides floating somewhere else, I'm now together with my content. And that makes for a much better experience for me, the presenter, and also hopefully for my audience members as well. Using Prezi video on its own, I can dive down into the habitat of the humpback whale. I can highlight lots more different facts about the whale and I could zoom in and out of each of those. Now that would make for a really amazing looking presentation, I'm sure you'll agree. But I've been asking myself one question lately. Can we get even closer or more specifically, could I bring you guys, my audience members, even closer to a humpback whale. And you might be thinking at this stage, what has Russell been drinking? <laughs> Don't worry, stay with me, because what I want you to do is I want you to follow these instructions that are just next to me right here. Grab your mobile phones, Android or iPhone, really doesn't matter. Use the camera to scan this image. Now, if you've got one of the newer iPhones or newer Android devices, when you scan that image with your camera, it will recognize that this is a QR code. This will take you uh, to an app that I want you to download. It's called iJack. It's a free augmented reality app. There's no strings attached. There's no catch at all. I'm not getting paid for promoting this app whatsoever. Um, if scanning that code with your camera does nothing though, maybe you're on a slightly older phone, you just need to open a web browser on your phone and type in this address, ijack.link forward slash whalewatch. It will take you to exactly the same content. Now, until you've done that, I want you to pause this video. Okay, hopefully you've done that now and you've unpaused the video and you've come back. And what you should see right now is that as well as me being here presenting my message to you in the standard way that I would on a video or a webinar, whatever it may be, you can now also see and you are much closer to an actual humpback whale. You should, if you're still holding your uh, mobile phone up and pointing it at that uh, QR code that's next to me there, you should see a 3D model of a humpback whale with sound effects as well floating around either above the laptop or to the side of the laptop that you're viewing this on. You can click on that on the screen of your phone and place it anywhere you want to in your home office right now or wherever you are in the world. And hopefully you'll agree that having me, the knowledge expert, presenting to you key facts about the humpback whale and also being able to zoom in on areas and move around your room while someone is talking to you about that, hopefully you'll agree that could make for an even more engaging experience. So I just wanted to kind of plant the seed with you on this video and get you guys to, first of all, go and grab a free Prezi license so that you can experiment and play with Prezi video. But if you think that you could also use augmented reality in your presentations, 
then I'd encourage you to follow these instructions and also go and download the free iJack app. It's very, very easy to use. You can create your own augmented reality very, very easily indeed. And let me know in the comments below, is this something that you can uh, see yourself using in a future business presentation? Do you think it would help bring your content to life even more? Have you tried it in the past? And what was good and what was bad? Let's start talking about this now because it's one thing to move over to Prezi Video and raise your game, but if you can raise it through the ceiling with something like this, then you're gonna be light years up ahead of the competition. So I hope you found this really useful. I'll be coming at you with lots of videos like this throughout the year. Let me know what you think in those comments below. Take care.